It seems like we've got another problem here. Uh, we're going to try to find a solution. I just got this thing here and I'm going to try to fix the problem with this one. We've got a big problem in here at the moment. There's a lot of water coming down into this uh, particular shop and the water just coming across from the top. We're going to go and have a look and see what's going on. But uh, it could be something that it could be very, very simple to fix. And uh, But you know, we want to we'll go up there and have a look. At the moment we've got uh, quite a lot of damage here. The ceilings are damaged. It could also be a big problem with the electrical cables because water and electricity, they don't go together, as you know. Or if you don't know, well, yeah, they don't. So what happens here, we could have a big, major disaster, like the, uh, the whole uh, system, actually, uh, the electrical system could collapse. A lot of the fridges will, won't work, and then, you know, we could have a problem with the food, and it's going to go up. So a major problem, a major problem out of probably nothing. We're just going to have a look now and see uh, what the problem is, but have a look at those pictures. What they've done here in order to just stop the uh, water just coming down into the, uh, the freezer room. I mean, it's unbelievable. It could be something very, very little, and uh, these people, they just don't know what to do. So, we're going to have upstairs. I've got a feeling that we can always fix it, and just very simple look, so simply with just this two. The problem is that this one here just came out of the space and what happens is all the water is just coming outside now and uh, the water just runs down into the shop and into the pool room and then into the rest of the ceiling. Now we had uh, a lot of damage down here, a lot of damage just because of this very simple thing. Look at that. I mean, you could just push that in, make sure that the water goes inside this when it's very easy. The owner here should have just got an adapter. You can get a square adapter that goes from square to round. Just get a proper adapter, put it here, and it wouldn't have been a problem. So the water coming out of here. Now, we don't have any parts here to fix it. We just picked up some, uh, have to do a temporary fix. A bit of aluminum will do the trick. Basically, we're going to dress it around so make sure the water goes inside the pipe. And then we're going to get an adapter and we're going to fix it out. But for now, this will just follow just do the job. So basically here, we just temporarily fix it up with just a little bit of aluminium from the spray that we picked up from the shop. It's going to do for now, at least there's no more water coming out. You can see this is all dry here. Everything is nice and dry. So all the water now basically, it just goes inside the pipe where it's supposed to go at the first place. Very simple. I mean, we're talking about a $5 part. That's how much this will have cost. And for $5, we just got so much damage down at the shop. And of course, all these days, all this disruption with all the water going everywhere. I mean, it's ridiculous. Just call someone, just get it down, but just don't let go. The owner was saying, oh, hang on, you know, it's going to stop right before we can fix it. Why? We're undercover here. What's his problem? Just don't put up with that. You know, just get things done. Very simple, efficient, it works. And now we're going to go and get the part, and we're going to fix it properly. Simple and efficient.